Veganism is a rapidly growing trend globally. In the US alone, an estimated 650,000 people follow a vegan diet, and it continues to attract the interest of many. Novi isn't an exception either. Veganism and vegetarianism are often confused. While both vegans and vegetarians do not eat meat products, vegans also do not eat other animal products such as milk or eggs. Being a vegan um, is the type of things you eat and maybe the types of things you wear, products that you buy. So for example, vegans um, don't eat anything that comes from an animal, so they don't eat the animal itself or eat any byproducts of them. So no meat, cheese, eggs. Um, dairy, anything of that nature. And so when it comes to products, you don't want anything that comes from an animal and or is tested on animals. I became a vegan about a year and three months ago. Um, I was a pescatarian before that for 13 years. I became a vegan because I did not want, um, I, f I wanted to see if I could be healthy without having to eat somebody else's mother, father, brother, or sister. So once I decide that I can do that, I stuck with it and I'm really happy with my decision. So, and it turned into like understanding connectivity of how we're all connected more and I've been able to study about it, it actually helps the planet. Um, so there's lots of things. Okay. Personally, I notice my energy level comes up. I like what I'm eating. Um, one thing that might seem silly is I've had brittle nails my entire life. I actually have strong, healthy nails since becoming a vegan. I've tried so many things years ago and nothing helped, like all these products and vitamins to try to get healthy nails. And um, since I became a vegan, they've been strong and healthy. That's one big thing. Um, energy level is huge, um, as well as I found out how it can help the environment and then the planet and society as a whole. So some challenges I face from being a vegan are going out to eat. Um, trying to find something besides just a salad, so just variety. Um, I have to say that's the biggest challenge, and to find desserts, because I love desserts, but I found places that um, make really good vegan desserts. I became vegan about three and a half years ago, um, because I don't know exactly how it started. I just, I did research, and I learned what at what cost the things that I was eating and drinking came at and I I remember one day I would just sit down and have a piece and eat a piece of cake and it wouldn't even taste good anymore. I know that I'm accomplishing something at the world in the world and uh, at very little cost. Like giving up things like cheese and chocolate. It's it's not such a big thing because there's so many substitutes nowadays and knowing that I I'm able to save not only the lives of animals, but of uh, people around the world. It's so good. At things like parties where there's not a lot of, like if, if you go to a birthday party and there's pizza or something, um, people think that it can be awkward to not partake in it. And I think that that's construed as a negative experience, but um, it's, not, it's really not as awkward as it seems. Okay, non-vegan ice cream does not taste as good as vegan ice cream.